Okay guys, so let's get started. Um, the first thing that I'm gonna use is a uh, eye primer. And like always, I'm using my e.l.f. eyelid primer. The next thing I'm gonna use is my e.l.f. pressed powder. It looks like that. And this is the powder that I use for my bronzer. I'm done with my hands. I had a project with my son. <laughs> School project. But anyway, so this is what I use for my bronzer. And this is in cocoa. So when I'm done with my bronzer, I just grab my other... I, trans, uh, I change to this brush that I actually use to contour my nose and stuff like that. I just grab it real fast, grab a little bit, and then place some right into the crease just like this just messy like messy it doesn't have to be perfect nothing like that the next thing I'm taking is my drinking a glass of shine palette by wet n wild and I'm gonna be using these natural colors I'm not using the brown but I'm gonna be using the black the orangish color which be like a peachish orange and then this which is the same color as brulee and I'm taking that on a angled fluffy brush. I'm going to take that peach color. And I'm going to place that right on top of that brown. Above the brown. Or. Yeah. That color. The next thing I'm going to take is this pointed brush right here. With that black, matte black color from the same palette. I'm gonna place it on the tip of the brush and right into the really like deep pocket of my crease. Again, keeping it on the outer corner. I'm gonna switch back to that angled fluffy brush and I'm gonna blend that out. And just keep blending until you get it the way you like it. Now after blending it out, you might have to go back with one of the two colors, either this color or that peachy color. And I'm just taking the same angle fluffy brush and kind of going over it just to kind of blend it a little bit better. And if it's starting to look too brown for you or too, yeah, too brownish, just go back with a tiny, tiny bit more black and dig out that crease one more time. Whoa. The next thing I'm gonna take is my flat, um, what is this? Professional Shadow Brush from e.l.f. and this uh, brulee color. Or any, um, if you want to use your face powder or anything like that, it would be a good color to use. I'm just going to place a little bit underneath my brow and blend down, making sure there's no harsh lines. And I'm also going to take a little bit of that and place it on my eyelid. Again, if you want to use your powder to do this it would be a good color also and that's just gonna give it more natural look. The last thing I do with this palette is I take a tiny bit of that same color and I actually go underneath my eyes to make them a little bit brighter. Now that we have that done, it should look like this or something like this. I'm going to go ahead and do my eyeliner. I have been loving this e.l.f. cream liner in black. I think it's in black. Yeah, black. And I am using uh, my 
Beauty Basics um, angled brush. This one does come with a brush. It's just too small for my hands. Other than that, I mean, I would use it, but. So I'm going to take a little bit of that cream liner and I'm going to do a wing just like this one. Kind of big since it's kind of like a, a light natural natural looking cut crease type thing. I want to add a little bit more drama to it. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. By the way, this cream liner is so smooth and so easy to work with. I actually really don't care for cream liners, but I'm really, really, really loving this one. And I believe this was only $3 on the e.l.f. website. So check that out. Sorry. Definitely check that out because um, it's really worth And the it. last step that I do is add a couple coats of mascara. And if you want to add more drama to this look, you can go ahead and put in false lashes. But I'm going to go ahead and add a couple coats of mascara. And that is it for the final look. You have a nice, soft, um, cut crease type uh, eyeshadow and a more natural lid with a nice drama you know kind of sultry um, eyeliner going on so yeah this is like I said really really easy I have been doing this um, in the morning for some time I have to get myself ready and my son ready so I mean it's really really fast and simple um, it literally takes me I want to say 15 20 minutes to do my makeup when a average makeup time for me um to actually do you know my makeup my type of makeup about an hour so 45 minutes to an hour so it's a really good time saving way to um get ready and still look like you actually got up out of bed and tried so yeah again here's the look and if you like it give me a thumbs up and let me know um, in the comments below if there's anything else you want to see. Um, I know St. Patrick's Day is coming up and I want to do a makeup look for it but I have been so busy um, I, you know, and I'm really really sorry about that guys but don't forget to check out the link below to find this and other cute jewelry, um, our arm candy is all that kind of good stuff. She has head change. Check her out and uh, free shipping anywhere in the U.S. So yeah, it's a really good deal. So go check her out and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye. Also, um, I got this really cute necklace. Hopefully you can see it. A little bow necklace. Um, from a friend that I, uh, from a good friend. God, why can't I say this? Okay. Also, I got this bone necklace from a really good friend of mine. Um, she puts, um, like arm candy sets together and she has really cute stuff. So, um, if you guys like this or, you know, with jewelry, any kind of jewelry, I mean, she has head chains. She has a lot of stuff on there that she sells. So if you like this or any type of jewelry, I would go check her out. Um, her website is, let's see, I have to look. she has an Instagram. If you want to check her out on Instagram, it's uh, My Posh Accessories. Let me
okay so if you're interested in this or any other kind of jewelry go check her out she has an instagram it's my posh accessories like you see that that's the instagram and there is the same as the website is uh my posh accessories.com right there in the blue and like i said she has some really 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 cute uh things that she puts together i love that bow bracelet i have to get that so yeah check her out and uh let me know what you guys think and give her some love and check her out also and yeah let's get on with the um video and again guys i am so so sorry i haven't been on um i am gonna try to make a video once a week and really try to make a video once a week my next video should be a um My next video coming up should be a St. Patrick's Day look because I really want to get into the St. Patrick's Day um, makeup. Green, I love green on makeup. So, yeah. But anyways, enough with the blabbing. Let's get on with the makeup. <laughs> 